What's up everyone? Welcome back. If you're new here, welcome. I'm Chris. And today I've got my Knowles Farm scent haul. And it's just a mini haul. It's not very big. Um, yeah, this is a long time coming because, let's see, it was shipped very quickly. And so two things I noticed. I used my, uh, my I think it was my shop pay. Well, I wasn't paying attention when I ordered it, and I had used my shop pay, and I had sent something to my boyfriend's house at one point or other, and I wasn't paying attention, and it shipped it there to him. So, okay, fine. So, I'm tracking my order, and I don't know, it was supposed to arrive on a Wednesday. Never came. It was still in transit and transit. It got stuck. I told this in one of my other videos. It got stuck. So, finally, it was delivered, and then I kept forgetting to take it home with me when I went there, and yeah, it just, you know, so now I finally have it here, and I decided to go ahead and finally get this video done on it, and I've also got a nasty cold, so fingers crossed my sniffer will work enough to be able to go through these scents with you. Okay, enough talking. Let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so I opened the box, and again, as always, packaged beautifully. You know, so forgive me. I'm a hot mess right now. It's been a long day. Um, it's Easter Sunday, and I have been going since... I don't know, 7.30 this morning and, uh, you know, got up, showered, went to my daughter's house in the morning to see um, the kids, my grandson and granddaughter, because they were doing an Easter egg hunt outside in the yard, um, even though it was like 40 degrees, but that's fine. It wasn't raining, so that's good. Um, and then I left there. And I drove out to my grandson's house. He lives about a half hour away from me. So I wanted to spend time with him today. So I did that. Then I came back home. Did a few things here. Then I went to my sister's for dinner. And my boyfriend came to my sister's house. And my grandkids, I saw them again. And I'm tired. I got a cold. And it's Sunday and I got to go to work tomorrow. I'm not happy. But... I do have wax, and wax makes me happy. So, anyway, Noel's Farm said it is owned by Travis and his lovely wife. And there's their business card. Um, I will have all their information in the description box below. And make sure you join their Facebook page, because that's where you get all the details on when there's going to be an RTS, a pre-order, what's going to be available, and when. And then, again, puts this in there. It's a thank you card. And <laughs> this is funny because, again, it was in my shop pay, the name and address. You know, it was my billing info, but it was my boyfriend's name and address, so it's just <laughs> Jerry. <laughs> Thank you so much. Enjoy, Travis. Anyway, I just thought it was cute. Okay, that's cute. I'm tired. Um, so we have, you know, their social media information to take a picture and post a snap of your order. And here is just some information on tips for melting. Comes in handy, you know. Okay. So let's dig in here. Again, I didn't, it, this was a, a small order, um, and I think there was a reason for that, and I can't remember what it is now, but, you know, there was a reason. Um, let's get these out of here. I think I was looking for, like, spring-summer scents is what I was going for at the time. Um... So I steered away from the bakery. Um, I have a lot of Travis's bakery. So I thought, you know what? I don't need any more bakery. Stick to spring summer scents. And let me check my invoice here. One, two, three, four. Yep, 
So I got four items and I did opt for the chunk bags, which come like this. All right, so first we'll start with the sample. And this sample is called 22. And it's a, an amazing sample. I mean, look at the size of that. And it is strawberry and cream, peach and raspberry, and currant and champagne. Fingers crossed, guys. Let's hope this is all working. I don't know. I tried to cover my big red Rudolph nose up a little bit because <clears throat> it's all red and raw. I have one nostril that's workable, so we're going to go with that one. Well, I really get the champagne in here. That's nice. Strawberry and cream, peach and raspberry. Okay. This is a very fruity champagne-like scent. Yes. It's very nice. There's a little creaminess to it, but not overly creamy. You still get the, the champagne note there a little bit. It's it's lovely. Mmm, I like that. Okay. And that one's called 22. All right, I wonder where he came up with the name for 22. Travis, if you're watching, let us know. All right, so I don't even know where to start because I'm excited about all these scents. And then I got one wild card here. I was just, I said, I really got to try this. All right, but we're going to start with this one. This one, there was a lot of talk on when we did our um, our live chat on this, on this pre-order. And that is Stay, Stay, Stay. Now, and here's the chunk bags. I, you know what? I really like the chunk bags. They're easy and, you know. Okay. So, we have Stay, Stay, Stay is caramelized vanilla and sea salt, macadamia, tonka bean, and coconut blossom. Now, we were speculating that this might smell like the Rio de Janeiro scent, but... Not sure. So let's just open it up and let it air a little bit. Okay, it's not what I thought it was going to smell like. But then my sniffer is off. You know, I maybe I should have waited to do this video, but, you know, I've been itching to get in this box because I've been watching everybody else's videos. Like, oh, I can't wait to smell it. Oh, I can't wait to smell it. Okay, I am really getting that caramel note in here. So that caramelized vanilla is really coming through. And the macadamia. So right now, as of today, with my stuffed up nose, <clears throat> I am picking up a caramel nut. That's what I am picking up right now. It's very smooth. It's very soft. It's not what I thought it was going to be. It's very, it's a creamy sweet scent. Um, I like it. I do. I like it. Again, I probably should have waited to do the video, but that's what I am picking up on cold right now is a creamy, caramely, vanilla, smooth creamy set with that nuts. I'm picking up the macadamia nut. Okay, this other one here is Midnight Rain. Now, this is Beach Evenings in Blackberry. I really like Knoll's um, Knoll's Farm and <clears throat> Beach Evenings. Um, it's just a little bit different. I do not have the scent notes for his beach evenings, but I, I it's it's unique and I like it a lot. This is pretty. This is very pretty. Totally get that blackberry mixed with the beach evenings, which is the Bath and Body Beach Nights type. Oh, that is pretty. You're getting those creamy marshmallows and the um, ocean or the sea, sea air, sea breeze, sea salty sea air, and the and the blackberries adding just this 
sweet note to it. Sweet. I don't want to say fruity, but yeah, it's a fruity note, but not like citrusy fruit. It's just a sweet berry on top of that beach nights or beach evenings. This is beautiful, you guys. Really beautiful. I would highly recommend this one. If he does a another pre-order and this is on it, even if it's just his beach evenings is on it, that's a beautiful scent. <clears throat> very, very nice. So that's Midnight Rain. So I would, again, highly recommend this is gorgeous. I'm looking forward to melting this. This was poured on 3.9. So again, I like to give his, just as with any vendor, I will give this at least four weeks. Okay. The next one is Lover. What's that? Pretty purple and pink. And this is Teakwood, Sandalwood, Amber, Ginger, Peppercorn, and Tobacco Leaf. And this one I was really excited about. Okay. Come on, nose, don't fail me now. Oh, wow. Oh. Really getting that tobacco leaf and the peppercorn. And it's with this beautiful... The sandalwood and the teak wood and the amber. Oh my god. Smooth, creamy, cashmere like. Um oh that tea, that peppercorn and tobacco leaf. You get the hint of ginger there, but it's not crazy. I absolutely love this. If I was going to reorder, definitely re I would reorder Lover in Midnight Rain. This is amazing. This is a beautiful, beautiful scent. You've got that woodiness, but that peppercorn and tobacco leaf. Oh, gosh, this is beautiful. And that amber just it gives it some richness and in depth to it and this is a pretty scent that's lover totally we get this again absolutely this is gorgeous this was poured on 3-3 so actually because <clears throat> today's the 31st so um this is pretty much ready to go however I'm not melting anything new until this is totally cleared up because I'm not going to uh, spoil it. I want to I make sure I can smell it. Okay, so here's my wild card. And I don't go for laundry scents. Generally, I don't. But this one intrigued me. This piqued my curiosity. And that was clean. And this is strawberry pound cake, raspberry, Spun sugar and laundry. And I thought, okay, that's interesting. It's like cleaned food. I, I wanted to try it. I thought, you know what? It can't be horrible. So let's check it out. But those scent notes were really, yeah, I wanted to try something different. This is really good. You do get the laundry there. But what's weird is you get that sweetness, that sweet pound cake in the berries. This is different. I like this. This is unique. I'm going to put you on pause one second. Sorry about that. I had to, you know... <clears throat> Okay. This is really, really cool. I am trying to think what this smells like. How could I describe this? <sighs> I can't describe it because I can't say, oh, it smells like 
Tide. It, no, it's... Because <laughs> Tide doesn't come smelling like strawberry pound cake and raspberries and spun sugar, right? This is just so different. It is so different. I really like it. I'm, again, I can't wait to try this one. Once I try it, I can give you a better idea of... So anyway, like I said, it was a very small haul. And again, this one's called Clean Strawberry Pound Cake, Raspberry Sponge Sugar, and Laundry. And it is very, very unique. And um, so yeah, that's all I got. Like I said, it was a small order because I was mainly trying to focus on getting spring summer scents um because i have so much fall and winter that i really need to stack my spring summer to get a good balance of what i've got so that's why i kind of just went with those scents because i thought i don't need any more bakery i don't need anything fall because rustic cookie cabin was on that one and that one's to die for but i'm like I don't need that right now. So, anyway, that's what I got. And again, join the Facebook group. Travis and his wife got really beautiful scents and very reasonably priced. Shipping on his pre orders are like lightning fast. Um, so, yeah. Check them out. Information in the description box below. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate everybody. I appreciate the time that you take out of your lives, your busy days, your busy schedules, and you watch a video I've uploaded. It means a lot to me. <clears throat> so please comment, like, and subscribe. And I am not going to do a warming video tonight because I really feel like dog poo. And uh, so, yeah. Everything will come later, but I did want to get my Knowles Farm sense recorded and up there for you. All right, everybody. Have a great night. Enjoy your week, and we will talk again real soon. Bye-bye.